chill. Wassa! Hey, this is the street where the younger people are. I'm in Krakow, Poland, just outside the city center. I'm on my way to the city center to check out the nightlife here. Is it gonna be like Las Vegas? Is it popping? Join me, let's go find out. I guess these are the Polish people that are heading home. We're gonna go find the party animals. Okay, this is one of the main streets here. You can see all kinds of tourists here. Some are probably Albanian, some Serbian, some Moroccans. And check it out, man. It's, it's like couple after couple and, and single guys. So if you take your girl here in this dreamy, amazing fairy tale vibe, you know what's gonna happen later on. But check it out, everybody's having fun. I think, I think what's missing, it's like how it was in Ukraine, there was people singing and stuff like that on the streets, people playing music. That's what's missing here. Krakow is weird, some places are like empty like this. And then you see Hukumiku Club has uh, a little bit of a crowd. Let's go in and check it out real quick. You can get your drinks here if you want. And if you want to go clubbing, I guess this is where you do it. Let's go check out the main square, how it is at night. One game I like to play is guess who the mother sucker is. These guys are obviously from Denmark. This guy is uh, Norwegian. What do you think? Germans, Austrians. <laughs> Dude, I'm like the best guesser in the world too. So I know I got most of them right. You see how nice it is? I'm telling you, all that's, all that's missing is uh, some musicians. So you got promoters here. What are you promoting? What club are you promoting? What club? Thank you. Choice. These guys are usually after me. And when I'm filming, they're not after me. <laughs> they say that uh, one of the most, one of the places that's not safe in Poland are the strip clubs. Somebody in the comments mentioned that. They're like, everywhere else is safe, but if you go to a strip club, you're gonna get robbed and everything like that. So watch out, I guess. But anyways, stop looking at my face and check out how active it is. On a Friday night, you got hot guys, hot girls, you know? This is pretty fun. And here, bring your girl here. You can have a nice romantic dinner over here, like these people. Look at them. They're gonna be having fun later this night. There's some French, there's some people from Belgium. Hello. It's pretty nice. And it's not just like one restaurant. It goes on and the square is gigantic. So you can literally have your pick here of the restaurants. Check out how, how vast it is. You got Polish restaurants, you got Italian restaurants and other cuisines, you know? Maybe some Serbian, I don't know. So I'm not really a hip guy. I don't know where the latest club is. I'm not those guys from What Is Love, you know, the guys that nod their head and go to the club. But if you're not a club person, you can get some cotton candy, enjoy it here, like these people are doing. 
walk with your girl or boyfriend, whatever you're into. I'm not, I'm not judging. I'm telling you, the only thing that's missing in this beautiful town is some mute live music. If that happens, where's the, where's, where are the Polish musicians? Come on, where's the violin, the banjo? It would make this place literally perfect. Anyways, let's go try to find some bars, see how they are. These are the usual bars on the main square. There is a street that's very busy. I'm gonna go there right now, but this is what you get on the main old town. This is usually the busiest one. But there's a street over there that's usually packed with younger people. Still though, very lively. Let's go check out that street that's packed with younger people. See what's going on there. Everybody's here just is out having fun. Usually you get people coming up to you asking you if you want to get go to a strip club or for, for me i think it's my nose everywhere i go whether it's las vegas krakow there's always somebody asking me if i want some coke like why you gotta make assumptions man just because i got a big nose what's up man okay this is the street where the younger people are usually and uh you got your McDonald's here, where people go after they get drunk, probably. Let's check it out real quick. Who's in here? Who's in McDonald's? Let's go through it. British, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, nothing. Nothing interesting happening in McDonald's, unfortunately. Let's go out and see what's happening. Oh man, the smell it smells terrible. I predict there's going to be at least three people asking me to get inside some strip club here. Check it out, it's not that active today. <laughs> got some uh, club here, space club, but it looks like it's dead. You got these chicks here and these guys ready to go dance and it's so weird. Like on this side of the on this side of town, there's like young people, and on the other side of town, it's like older folks. And you got to give me credit for making this observation super quickly. Banya Luca, this is a very popular joint. Hello. Just, uh, just a vlog? What? It's just for a video? Oh, okay. Thank you. Let's check it out. This seems to be an active joint here. Once, once it gets a little bit late, everybody comes to these kebab joints. I think it's like the highlight of people's day after a night out. They come get some kebab. There it is, it's just waiting for people. Hello. And if you're not into kebab, which is probably probably me at night, I wouldn't eat kebab. I would, I would get one of these ice creams. For sure, something with banana. Not the sorbet. Who gets sorbet? Hi. That guy was hopeful. He's like, I'm gonna be selling some ice cream. Nothing.
What's going on here? Usually there's nothing going on in the day. What are they selling? It's too early to get pizza. Polish people are getting... Yeah, that's a pizza. Is it that good for there to be this big of a line? What's going on? Uh-oh, uh-oh. They're coming for me? Oh man, what's happening? So this guy is drunk. Whew, I thought they're coming for me, man. That's crazy. I feel like this video is so random. <laughs> I'm just like wandering around. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna show you one last thing that's super cool in Krakow. It's a tradition for Polish people and it's a good end to this video, I think. Let me go show you. Hello, strip club for you maybe tonight? Free entry, sex and strip club. inside? Strip club, strip really? Club, the best My strip future club wife is there? What? Future Fe wife? Future maybe wife? No. just check. <laughs> I'm good, thank you though. I always get invited to strip clubs. I'm a, I'm a VIP. Okay, now this is the tradition here in Poland. This is how some people start their night. And this is how some people end their night. It's the freaking kill Basa. Check it out. Excuse me. Check out the line. Excuse me. Check out the line of Polish people, dude. This is this is how most people. This is like the tradition here in Poland to either. I think it's end your night here after after you get drunk, you get a kielbasa from this famous truck. Personally, I don't think it's the best sausage. There's much better sausages in Poland, like the white sausage and the Vista, way better. But this, I just wanted to show you here how Polish people end their night or start their night. I'm not sure exactly, one of them. And this is a perfect place to end the video. Tomorrow is gonna to be a much more exciting video. I'm doing Polish bread. Bread is a huge part of the Polish culture. So make sure you tune in. Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Peace out, I'll see you on the next one.